Hello and welcome to this new video. In this video I want to show you how you can install Windows 11 on a computer that doesn't have the minimum system requirements. For example, if you don't have a TPM chip like I have here if Oracle VirtualBox, the, the TPM feature is currently not supported and then if you run the Windows setup you will get the message this PC can't run Windows 11. But you can circumvent that and I will show you how to do that in this video. Everything I describe here will be also available in this blog post. Click the link below in the video description. Okay, we have to change the registry in order to allow the installation on non-supported systems. And in order to do that, we go back here and then we press Shift and F10. This will open a command prompt and this command prompt allows us to enter rec edit and hit enter and then the registry editor will be started. Now we have to navigate to the following key here. Let's put this window over here and we have to go to computer hey key local machine system setup. Okay, let's do that. Hey key local machine system setup. And here we have to create a new key. Right click on it, new key, and name this lab config. Okay, here we go. And now we have to create three registry keys. The first one uh, are dword values. Right click here and select new dword value. And the first one goes by the name bypass tpm check. And this has to be set to one. And as you can imagine, this will bypass the TPM check, uh, check. For example, if your computer does not have a TPM chip or the incorrect version, you can bypass the TPM check. We have to create two other keys, bypass RAM check and bypass secure boot check. Okay, new dword value, bypass RAM check. This will bypass the minimum RAM uh, requirements and bypass secure boot check and both have to be set to one and well that's it now we have these these three values double check for errors uh, for spelling errors or typos um, otherwise it won't work okay now we can close the registry editor and the command prompt and now we can just continue our installation here i hit next and Instead of the error message that this PC cannot run Windows 11, we now get the uh, license terms. And if we cl click next, now we can install Windows 11. And this will install, for example, here in Oracle VirtualBox. And this will also work on a real computer. Okay, well, that's it. That's, you. that's how you can install uh, Windows 11 on non-supported hardware without TPM support and as I mentioned before everything you can read up here in our blog post. Okay well that's it. Goodbye.